Welcome to my account. I'm Milou and I'm here with a new process video. Uh, maybe you've seen it, but this layout I'm showing you right now, I did make a few days ago and I have a process video also on my channel. And if you're interested and haven't seen it yet, I will leave the link down below. Um, right now I'm working on part two and part two is the front of the lay or no, the back of the layout. Um, like you can see, I'm using the, the page protector type G from Project Life. And that means I have three 4x4 four four cards in there and three 4x3 four cards. Um, yeah, I had a little bit too much or too many pictures uh, for a normal 12x12 12 12 layout. So I decided to use this one instead. Uh, because of the uh, 4x4, there is a little bit more room to uh, use your photo to to include some photos. Um, yeah, in this layout, I'm using the same as in the other. Uh, yeah, the back of this layout, I used the Oh Happy Life line from Amy Tangerine, and. Yes, I am, sorry, I'm a little <laughs> bit looking for words right now. I am making this layout as part of the paper issue spring crop. I don't know if you've heard of it, um, but it's over on Facebook and there were, was a whole weekend of scrapping online and um, you can still participate until next weekend. But there were about 23 challenges you could participate in. And this one is around the, ba the band I choose. And the challenge is that you use your um, journaling in a different way. Um, that's why you saw me here uh, journal around the edge of the card. Normally, if you are familiar to my account, um, you see me using faux stitches as a border. But at this point... But at this page, I use um, the journaling, at least at the yellow um, Project Life card. I didn't do it on the, um, the other one, with which I'm working on now, because I did not have enough journaling. Um, as you could see, I used some clear stickers for this layout. Those are from my mind's... No, that's not true. Mambi. Uh, me and my big ideas is that and there are from kind of a love uh, series but as you can see this page has nothing to do with love at all um, well a lot of it friends and you can count it as love but I didn't use sayings about love um, and you can see I could still use those phrases um, because I have a lot of pictures on this page and on the top here you can see I even cut down a picture over two different pockets. I intend to leave my um, layout a little bit quieter. I use less embellishment than you're maybe used uh, than I am used to actually. And here I use some leftovers from some hexagons. And because they go underneath the picture, you won't notice that they only have. I'm also using some washi tape. And as you could see, I fussy cut the camera out. Um, if you have watched my previous video, then you have seen me stamping that. And I use that as my embellishment. I also use some puffy hearts, those are from Aliexpress and of course <laughs> I use my Tim Holtz tiny word stickers which I'm looking through right now to find a phrase I, I, I like. Um, actually that's kind of it what I'm using for this page. Like I said, because it's a bit busy with the photos I and um, the paper with the words is quite busy too. I intend to leave it, the rest of it a little bit more quiet. Um, so yeah, I am journaling around this picture or around the uh, 
card still here and here you can see it's not just around the picture but at, uh, at the edge of the card and right now I'm going to work on oh yeah sorry no not yet I was saying a, a work on the title card but that's next first I am doing my faux stitching if you have seen my other videos then you know I love faux stitching as a border and because I did not have enough journaling for all the cards I only did that around the yellow cards I'm not sure actually if I already said that because I just uh, made my Dutch voiceover and I'm like, am I repeating myself from this voiceover or was that the last one? I hope it was the last one, but otherwise you heard it twice. I'm sorry in advance. <laughs> um, here I'm working on my title card and as you could see I made a basic with the washi tape and I used my two-pointed flag punch from EK Success to make a banner and now I'm using these um, alphas, those are from Jelly Bean Soup, if I'm right, uh, to put down the week number, week 35, and I will use my tiny attacher to attach the banner. And because it's the only plaque I used my tiny attacher, I was like, no, I wanted to come back somewhere else. So I decided to uh, um, use it with my tiny word stickers too. Then you have a bit, it, it's more balanced in the layout. Right now I'm using my uh, Heidi Swap date stamp. I It's a week so I have two dates to stamp and I put a little heart in between. Um, yeah, I put a little heart in between. <laughs> I was like I'm gonna say something else but I did not know what. <laughs> okay, end of the sentence. <laughs> um, so yeah, I think I'm almost finished, yes. Um, maybe you have seen it, but this video, the light is a little bit darker than you're used to for my videos, because it's the first time I'm filming at night. I don't have um, a daylight lamp or studio lamp or something like that, I'm just using my normal light. I wanted to try that and see how it was I I think it's a little bit dark and the thing that's annoying me the most is that you see a lot of uh, shadow from my arms so I think I will keep filming in day uh, in daylight for now and the summer is coming up so then it will be um, lighter during the evening too and maybe next winter I will think about buying some lamps so I can also film at night. Well here it was, if you liked my video please give me a thumbs up, subscribe to my channel and I hope to see you next time. Thank you for, thank you for watching, bye!